a huge relief for some families in Alberta. The provincial government announcing today that they will fund an extremely expensive drug that treats a rare genetic disorder. The condition, known as spinal muscle atrophy, affects muscles used for head and neck control. Children left untreated by the age of two usually do not survive. And the gene therapy called Zolgensma goes for a whopping $2.8 million. The health minister today is saying there's no cap for funding, but it will be provided on a case-by-case -case basis as the province waits for the drug to go on Alberta's formulary. We just don't want kids to fall through the cracks. So the case-by-case -case basis is making sure that nobody is, is coming up to um, an age that would then um, adversely affect their eligibility criteria um, after there, there is funding. So this is um, an opportunity for us to work with the, uh, the drug manufacturer uh, Novartis to make sure that that doesn't happen. City News has been following the story of Rain, whose family has been advocating for government funding for over a year. Rain turns two in March and they're beyond excited with this news. We feel so relieved just to know that Rain's not getting left behind um, and all this work that we've been doing has really in the end paid off. Rain is on this, assi this BiPAP assisted breathing for you know 24 hours um, you know really round the clock and uh, Zolgensma really provides that opportunity for him to come off of this mask, you know, completely. Doctors are now able to submit applications on behalf of families looking to receive the genetic therapy. And Rain's family is hoping to get approved for treatment within the next 30 days. From Edmonton, Ashna Barkata, City News.